What is GraphQL? GraphQL is an open source and cross platform query language for APIs. It was created by Facebook in 2012 for use in their mobile applications. After, it was open sourced in 2015. GraphQL is a query language for your API that shifts the contract between clients and servers that allows the server to say these are the capabilities that I exposed and allows the clients to describe their requirements in a way that ultimately empower product developers to build the products they want to create. Dan Schaefer, GraphQL Co-Creator What are the key concepts of GraphQL query language? Product-centric Hierarchical Strong typing. Client specified queries. Introspective. Write an example GraphQL query. Query looks like Students. Name. Grade. The response for the query is given below minus. Data. Students. Name. Jack. Grade. A. Name. John. Grade. A plus. Name. Nick. Grade. B. What is the use of schema? GraphQL schema is core part of GraphQL server. All the queries are validated and executed against the schema. The schema describes the possible data that a client can access. What is use of mutation? It is used for the right operations. It is used for operations like add, delete and edit data. What are enums in GraphQL? Enums are basically a special type we can use to enumerate all possible values in the field. By using enums we are adding another kind of validation to existing GraphQL schema. What is the use of SDL? SDL stands for Schema Definition Language. It is used for writing schemas. What is modify s in GraphQL? Modifier is a special group of type in GraphQL. These types can be defined as follows. A modifier modifies the type to which it refers. What is use of subscription? It is used for listening to any data changes. The server will notify the client on any data change if the client is subscribed to that event. What is use of GraphQL Voyager? It is an open source library used to represent any GraphQL API to an interactive graph. What is a resolver? A resolver is a function that returns data for a particular field. Resolver functions return data in the type and shape specified by the schema. What is the use of type diffs parameter? It is a required argument. It represents a GraphQL query as a UTF-8 string. What are the scalar types in GraphQL? Int, signed 32 or integer. Float, assigned double precision floating point value. String, a UTF-8 character sequence. Boolean, value true or false. ID, is a unique identifier often used to fetch an object again or as the key for cache. What are big companies using GraphQL? Facebook, GitHub, Pinterest, Twitter, PayPal, Atlassian, Audi, Sky, The New York Times, Shopify, Yelp, and more. What is the difference between overfetching and underfetching? Overfetching is extra data for an API request it increase payload size. Underfetching is the opposite of overfetching. It means that not enough data is included in an API response. It requires multiple API calls to fetch the complete data. Can you explain how GraphQL helps in low network area? A client can request only the required data in GraphQL. It makes the payload size smaller than any other network request. In low network areas, Small payload network requests can be executed faster. What is the use of introspection? Introspection allow you to ask GraphQL schema for information about what queries it supports. 
What are the different types of introspection? Underscore shima. Underscore type. Underscore type akind. Underscore field. Underscore input value. Underscore inum value. Underscore directive. What are the different type definitions? Scalar. Type. Interface. Union. Inum. Input. What are type modifiers in GraphQL? String, nullable string. String, required string. String, list of strings. String, required list of strings. String, required list of required strings. How to host a GraphQL server online? To create GraphQL server on any programming language like Node.js or Python. To host it like any other servers. How can queries be used to modify data? Queries can be used to modify server-side data. But according to the conventional method, it is the best practice to use mutation for any write operation. Can you explain how GraphQL helps in data loading process? It can provide the minimum amount of data that is required by the client. Even if the object model contains a lot of fields, the client can request only the required fields. What is list in GraphQL? A GraphQL list represents a sequence of values. It is possible to view these values as arrays, for example in JavaScript, although the analogy is not completely precise. Can you define fragment in GraphQL? If our query is large and we have reusable units in the query, we can create fragment by taking the reusable part and use that fragment in the query. It helps us to arrange the code and also to avoid duplicate code. What is use of underscore tip a name? Underscore tip a name is a meta field. If the client doesn't know the type getting back from a GraphQL service, GraphQL allows us to use underscore tip a name to get the name of the object type. What is syntax of over HTTP in GraphQL? Get. Fetch my API web link me, name. Post. Fetch my API web link. Body, json.stringify. Query, dot. Operation name, dot. Variables. Write a query in input arguments. Basic input. Type root. Users limit, int, user. Input with default value. Type root. Users limit, int equals 10, user. Input with multiple args. Type root. Users limit, int, sort, string, user. Input with multiple args and default values. Type root. Users limit, int equals 10, sort, string, user. Or. Type root. Users limit, int, sort, string equals ASC, user. Write a query in enums. In a margb. Red. Green. Blue. Type root. Color, RGB. What are the differences between REST API and GraphQL? REST API. REST is an architectural pattern concept for network-based software. REST API easy to understand. Data fetch, a typical usage of REST API will fetch data by calling multiple API endpoints, and the server will return all data in those endpoints. The shape and size of the resource is determined by the server in REST. In REST, you specify a write by changing the HTTP verb from get to something else like post. It uses different routes for requests. It is server-driven application state. REST only communicates on HTTP or HTTPS. GraphQL GraphQL is a query language for APIs and set of tools that operate over a single endpoint using HTTP. GraphQL is a flexible and easy to backup. Data fetch, it uses queries, schema, and resolvers. Developers can specify the exact data they need, moreover, they can create and execute nested queries. In GraphQL, 
the server declares what resources are available, and client asks for what it needs at the time. In GraphQL, you change a keyword in the query. In GraphQL, doesn't have any roots. It is contract driven by nature. GraphQL server communicate over HTTP, HTTPs, TCP, WebSocket, UDP, FTP. Which graphical libraries are used in Java, Python, JavaScript, TypeScript, and PHP? For Java, GraphQL Java. For Python, Graphy. For JavaScript, Express GraphQL. For TypeScript, Type GraphQL. For PHP, GraphQL PHP. Which GraphQL library is used in Android and iOS application? Apollo Client is used to both Android and iOS application. What type of response you get after a GraphQL query? When a client requests a query, the server returns the JSON format response. The response returned by the server is based on the query the client uses for the request. What are some best hides and tools for GraphQL APIs? GraphQL on browser IDE for exploring GraphQL APIs. Graph CMS build a GraphQL content API. Bit open source tool and reusable code. Relayit is a library for GraphQL.js. Apollo client and server optimize GraphQL queries. GraphQL Voyager for interactive visual graph. GraphQL IDE the GraphQL Playground. GraphQL Editor for backends from GraphQL Schema. Prismo Build GraphQL Server with ease. GraphQL Bindings for reusing and sharing GraphQL APIs. GraphQL Network Network Style Tab allowing for easy debugging. Which companies are used in GraphQL? Facebook Twitter PayPal Pinterest Shopify Dailymotion Guidehub Yelp Magento Intuit Arnab, and more What are the pros and cons of GraphQL? Pros it is best option for complex systems and microservices. GraphQL schema. Fetching data with a single API call. Auto-generating API documentation. Support for real-time data. Code sharing. Easy find errors with clear message. Rapid application prototyping. Cons. Complex queries. Learning curve. Web caching is more complex than with REST. No leverage from HTTP. JSON representation only. File uploading issues. Schema similarities. Like share and comment. Don't forget to click the subscribe button. Click the bell button for latest updates.